ready. Go. Okay, we're in Scotland, and this is an auricularia, a wood ear mushroom. The Chinese know it as motor. And um, these wood ear mushrooms gained uh, a reputation medically because at the University of Minnesota Medical School um, about two decades ago, they were the students at the med school were doing a, a skin prick test to see how quickly they could blood clot. And one student, when they pricked their finger, continued to bleed and did not clot, which is very unusual. And the professor asked the student, are you a normal clotter? And he said yes. And he profusely bled for a very long period of time, well past the norm. And so they started asking him, well, what type of foods have you been eating? And sure enough, uh, the previous night, he was at a Chinese restaurant. And he had wood ear mushrooms, moer mushrooms. Um, now, moer also was known um, medically, it was discovered uh, to be the cause of what's called Sichuan purpurea, which um, Anglo women, uh, when they started eating at Sichuan, Sichuan restaurants, they would sneeze or cough and they'd break blood vessels in their face. And so all these dermatologists were seeing these European uh, uh, ladies. Uh, that had Flushing. blood vessels broken in their face. And then it was discovered that moer has an anticoagulant, a blood thinner. Mm -hmm. And so this mushroom has a very potent anticoagulation -co compound that thins the blood. And that could be important for uh, uh, if people who have unusually high cholesterol, if they have blood clots, etc. Mm -hmm. uh, having a blood thinners is medically you know, very important. So this is a natural source of a blood thinner.